let's look at a simple vehicle details. Uh, that is a simple vehicle maintenance database. And the first form here, uh, just to do the demonstration, is that we have the vehicle details and customer data. Therefore, these are the feeds that we have. We have the vehicle ID, customer ID, the description, vehicle year. We have um, MED, that is make ID, car. We have license plate, vehicle number, and also we have the notes. We can also add the picture or the photo of the system. On the other hand, we have the services, we have the services table and also form here therefore this one we have uh, this part where you can have the service id you can also get the vehicles therefore as we add more vehicles like for example if i just come here and add a new vehicle uh, if we add another one kcc 456p then the customer owning this one is done each time and the description of this one is just a, a personal car search then the year will automatically uh, come uh, in place here you can also choose the car and you see you cannot add the car then from there for example you can just have this one duplicated here you have it there we also have it there then you can just say that um, uh, I have are taking the car for brake riding search then you just uh, refresh so if we also refresh this one here the proposition to see that uh, I can now be in a position to capture the next vehicle here automatically just by going to add new then I can now go to this so that I can have the service number changed also as you add more vehicles in your database you realize that uh, the this one is also uh, taken care of it is updated automatically here therefore from this point also you can be in a position to switch between the two tables uh, the two forms like i have uh, uh, we have seen so uh, what you need to do for you to come up with such a database you can just uh, uh, right click on your desktop go to new then go to microsoft database if i can just have our that is our vehicle uh, maintenance maintenance uh, pro then you open your table just like you you have seen then you just go to enable content then go to create table therefore you can just create our tables you can start with cara therefore our cara here will be our primary key therefore we need to have uh, our cara as the primary key here so uh, that uh, you, somebody cannot really add more caras if i save this one as cara that way then you run type your caras here you have red can have orange we can also have others like yellow yellow we can have uh, blue we can also have white so once i add these ones because i have set the feed as primary key the user cannot add more colors when using the lookup wizard that is the importance then we just go again table design we create the next table the next table here will be our make table therefore we have make make id we also have the make name search then this one we can just have this one as auto number right way then just go down here format we can just have quotes double quotes then this one is our make then zero zero uh, that is the format for that therefore this is our make our make table we just save that one therefore we haven't uh, have the primary key just set this one as the primary key this one is our primary key then you save our table make then we go again create a table design we create another table the next table is model therefore model model id model id 
can have the model ID, this is auto number also, just go as the primary key, go down here, go to format, we can have our double quotes, this is our model, then zero, oh, sorry, 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 our model, therefore we have our model as zero, zero. Then you just go to have the, the that is the model ID, you can have the model name, the model name search if we just save that one this is our model table model then uh, if i run this one for the model you can have jeep you can have ford you can have benz benz search so if now i go to this one again here that is what they make you can still have something like uh, uh, subaru can have Toyota, you can have uh, Scania, such. Then I can just, just right click here, cross all. If I have half that one, then create, just go to table design. We need now to create the service. That is the service. Uh, I can start with the vehicle, the vehicle, uh, vehicle ID. Then you can have the customer, the, sorry, you can have the customer, customer who owns that vehicle. Then you can also have the vehicle here, the vehicle here. So this is the vehicle here, this should be number. Then uh, this here should be the primary key. Then you have the make make ID you can also have the model model ID then you can also have the color the color the car. then you can have other details like notes such then uh, I needed to do a bit of validation and uh, that is validation here. Therefore, just go to the year. Here, the year of the make. Just go down here. Go to default value. Therefore, it should be equals to year. This is today. And then date. That is today. today the year. The year. Then, this year should be greater than 2000 and less or equal to now here here that is the date this is year date and then plus one that means 2022 you cannot have 2022 and therefore this one is between year 2000 that is 2001 and 2022 somebody cannot enter 2025 2023 search then from there just go back here go to uh, make just go to look up wizard therefore go to this option i want to look up get values from another table then we just have uh, that one is uh, make so we go to make then go to next send everything to your right hand side next next uh, next then just go back here uh, then we, we can have finish save that one this is a uh, vehicle this is a VA vehicle vehicle then just go to model id go to lookup wizard then go to the same same option next this time around we are going to the that is to the make 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 now we are going to the model if we just go to the model next send everything next here you can just choose uh, to arrange with that one next and then here just make sure these feeds are available then finish therefore uh, after doing that you can just go to the car the car again go to look up wizard go to this option here next go to car next you want the car next next finish then you save the table Therefore, after having done that, ladies and gentlemen, then you can be in a position now to 
cross this, then create the Rust table. Go to table design, cross this, create table design. We are creating the service, therefore the service, the service, the service ID. Then we go to vehicle, it is the vehicle number. Vehicle number. Vehicle number. Number. Then you can have the description. The description. We can have the date service. Servicing dates. Therefore, this is the date and time. Date and time. Then you can have this one as the primary key. Then car number. Just go to Ruka Wizard here go to option number one i want the lookup field to get values from another table next then you can just go to vehicle next then vehicle number then next you can just have them uh, in setting order next and then next then finish good this is service servicing servicing uh, what is servicing? Then I just go to next field. The next field is my reach, my my reach, my reach covered. Then cost, then cost. Then you also have the notes. You have the notes. And for the notes here, you shall use memo or wrong text for that case. Then I can just save my stuff here. Save. Then after saving, I cross this one. If I just right click, uh, right click and cross. If we can just go to the vehicles, let's just capture a few vehicles. K B C one one H. You can also have K B B H. Whatever K. You can also have the last one K C A T. Good. Then the customer here can have Faith. Can have Jacob can also have Martin. Then just see, this one is automatically uh, coming up uh, just because of the default value. And if you try to key in something like 2000, you see now you will get an error message between year 2001 and 2002. You can also not put 2023. It's out of range that way. Therefore, the range must be between the acceptable range. So that is 2021. Then, ladies and gentlemen, I cross this. Then I just go now to create. Then, uh, for this time round, I want to create uh, forms in a faster way. Therefore, I just hit on the table. Then, click on this. Therefore, you click on this here, this one, form. It will automatically create a form uh, for that case. Therefore, there we are. Therefore, you can see. Uh, it has created it has created a form automatically and uh, I can be in a position now to run. so ladies and gentlemen if you just go to design view of this one now you have the idea on how this one is done you see I have not used any code just using the default Microsoft uh, controls here therefore that's how now you see now when you just have this one you have the color table here you have the cara table you can have now the make table you can just add t to show the makeup model services then the vehicle uh, details so if you run this one now you see you are in a position now to be in a position to do as you wish that's how actually i did or uh, have done into in, in making sure that um, I come up with this system. Therefore, ladies and gentlemen, you can download copies of various databases that I have done from my website. The URL or the website address is just below this video. Remember to subscribe. Also, remember to uh, remember to comment. Thank you.